Hello, I'm Father James Kubicki. Today the church celebrates a feast in honor of one of the patron saints of youth, Saint Aloysius Gonzaga. He was the eldest son of a prominent Italian nobleman who wanted him to follow in his footsteps and even sent him to be a page in the court of King Philip II of Spain. But Aloysius desired instead to serve a different king, the king of heaven and earth, and told his father he wanted to become a Jesuit, the religious order to which I belong. At first his father opposed him, but in time allowed him to join the Jesuits where, as a seminarian, he sacrificed himself serving the sick after a plague broke out in Rome. He died on this day at the age of 23. For our prayer today, I've chosen a reflection from an old Jesuit manual of devotions. God and eternity were all things to Aloysius. His love of God, tender and strong, explains his unbounded desire of self-sacrifice. God was ever uppermost in his thoughts. The thought of eternity was his one standard of action. The more closely any action or course of conduct was connected to God and eternity, the more directly it led to God, the more certain he was to choose it. O oh, blessed Aloysius, who despised not only the honors of the world and its riches, but your own self in order to follow Christ in a life of poverty and sacrifice, and thus consecrated yourself heart and soul to the love and service of God, teach us the secret of the love of God. Enlarge our hearts and strengthen our wills, and obtain for us the grace to forget self and to work for God alone. May we have that clearness of vision with which you viewed all things, so that we may understand the unworthiness of all worldly and selfish aims, and strive only for God and the things of God. Amen.